Hey guys, welcome back. It's Deedzy, and today we're doing another episode of Old School Rips. We've got Fleer 1995. I'm here today with my brother. Hello there. And uh, he's here to join me. He's uh, on vacation this week, hanging out. So we're going to be opening a bunch of cards this week. So we've got a couple Old School Rips. We also got some um, new stuff as well we wanted to try out. But this is one of our favorite sets we had when we were kids. Uh, loaded with inserts. Um, lots of Hall of Famers in this set, which is really great. Here's a look at the box, kind of the different variations of all those different cards that they came with. Each uh, division had a different, uh, basically, design. And here are the inserts. About 10 different sets there, roughly. So uh, let's get, get this guy opened up and see what we got inside. We got his uh, special knife today. He brought that with him just for opening cards. So. This set's uh, been a pretty fun set for us. We opened this one actually quite a bit just because it has a lot of... Uh, Nostalgia to it, obviously. And a lot of players we collect. As always, I'm looking for Griffey cards and cool Griffey insert cards. And uh, he's looking for uh, Twins cards. He's a big Curry Puckett fan, so... This one's a little different. It's got the little... Uh, That's kind of nice. Weird tear on the front there. So this is actually a retail box. So we'll... Put these guys up in stacks. Do you have a preference on stack? No. Top or bottom? Look at that pack. It's at an angle. Let's see that pack for last. Yeah, it's a special pack. Stack these up. The one most difficult card to get is the... Um, there's a little card that is um, a redemption card, which is probably the worst redemption card I've ever seen. Um, it was like 1 in 150 packs. Start hoping to get one of those today. You can get hot packs as well. Here's the front of the pack here. Yeah, I remember those hot packs. They're so awesome. You get all inserts. Here is, you can do a wrapper redemption. This set actually had a lot. There was a rookie exchange set, the 150 packs, and also wrapper redemption you can send in as well. I might post those uh, later on so you guys can see those. But let's uh, get these things open and see what we got inside. Pretty fun set. And let's hope these guys are not stuck together. They are. <laughs> a couple of them are, just a little bit. We got Matt Williams, Larry Walker. Like I said, gonna be a lot of Hall of Famers. I'll divvy mine up. Put Hall of Famers in one stack there. Each uh, different set is a little bit different. It's like this, like the uh, NL West right here, and it is a little stuck together. Here's the back of the card. They're all gonna look about the same. Good amount of stats in the back, which is cool. Thirty-six packs in a box, which is awesome. Here's our first insert. These are the All-Stars. So you had a guy from the National League and the American League. Whoops, yep. they're stuck together on the front Those side the there. Those are the most common, weren't they? These are the most common. A couple pitchers. That's probably one of the most uneventful inserts you can get right there. Yeah. And a couple other dudes there. There's pack one, guys. Nothing too crazy, but we did get a Larry Walker. Let's see if you can pull something better. Looking for hey. a... Twins right at the gate. There you go. Checklist card. All right. Got to love checklist cards. Seven checklists. Another twins. Wow. Different colors. Let's go. Ramon Martinez, Ramon brother of Pedro. Yeah. Nah. Oh, yeah. Here we go. The rookie sets. Those are fun. The rookie prospect cards are really cool. A Rod and Jeter are the best two in that set. Right. Always good to get those two. Nothing great there. Brian Hunter. That was a cool card. We got Tim Raines. John Crook. He was always fun to watch as a kid. I love watching him. <laughs> Some twins there. There's your card. There's your card off the cover, which is really funny because if you look at the cover. That is not what the card actually looks like. I don't know why they put it on a different background. That is interesting. Yeah. That is very weird, but yeah, that's your former rookie of the year. And here we go. We got another prospect, Ray Durham for the White Sox. He's a pretty good player. He's fun to watch. I liked him. As, I, I collected his cards as a kid. And there's our first Mariners one, Dave Fleming, Luis Gonzalez, and Juan Gonzalez. Fun. And I got one more stuck there. Sweet. Couple good guys there. Petey. BJ Sirov. <laughs> I'll put that radar up there. Let's go. 
cards stick together. That's the only, only thing about these old cards. Ah, Fred and Griff. And, yeah. Not a good guy. Mickey Townsend, yeah. <laughs> Other cool insert set is the Lumber Company set, which yeah, is really cool. That one's pretty dope. Got Griffey, Frank Thomas, Barry Bonds. So that's definitely uh, one of my favorite ones. And then I did have on this channel before, I think I showed off a couple of the ProVision cards, um, which this set was really cool because they um, they actually, the six card set connects together. So hopefully we get a few of those. I always try trying to get the whole set of those. The same All right, here is next pack. I thought that this was the weirdest uh, set because you had like the guy in the background. It was like just discolored and like, really weird looking. Some of them are really kind of creepy looking. Couple still stuck together. We got like 36 packs. There is a lot in here. Let's Other Mariner. Definitely looking for Griffey. And hey, I was talking about those Pro Vision cards. Got the first one here. And that is going to be Mike Mussina. Oh, yeah. I love those. Those are so cool. Warning. If we, get a, if we get a set, we'll try to connect them at the end, That's maybe. That's right, they connect. But yeah, they got six of them, they all connect together. So I think the hardest one for me to find um, as a kid was the Manny Ramirez. Um, that one took me the longest to get. This set, we bought so much this set. I have the complete set. I have like every single insert you can get. Um, we had hot packs, which were fun, which were all inserts as well. So what was, what's your favorite background? I, I think my favorite is, I think the AL West. Okay. Of course, I'm partial because the Mariners were in that one. Sure. But I like the look of it. I thought that it was hey, cool. Hey, These are cool. War winners. Bob Hamlin, the glasses. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I forgot about that. <laughs> those are pretty cool because those are got that yeah. embossed foil that's raised, which is really yeah. cool. Yeah. And it actually sure. comes through the back as well, which is really awesome. But those are fun. Frank Thomas is the, is the number one card in that set, which is really cool. It's like Heat Vision or something. Yeah, it kind of is, isn't it? I'm not sure which one is my favorite. I know I love this set as a kid because there was a lot of Griffey inserts because, you know, obviously mid-90s, he was crushing it and just doing so good. It's a checklist. They're just a very unique set, you know, look-wise. Yeah, very busy um, and just tons of inserts. They had an update set that came out as well. The biggest highlight of that update set was um, Hideo Nomo's rookie card was in there, which was really cool. I remember getting those when they came out around my birthday that year. And I got a couple packs for my birthday and got uh, a Hideo Nomo. I was so stoked as a kid <laughs> to get that. Good picture. And here is our all-star insert. Matt Williams, Wade Boggs on the Yankees. Still weird to see him on the Yankees. I still think of him as a Red Sox. No Griffies yeah, yet. Right. No. There's a lot of Frank Thomas cards in this set as well, I believe. You haven't got really, really yeah, there's, there's a Hall of Famer, Ozzy yeah. Smith. Yeah. The Wizard. Where's your is this the uh, Yeah, the Hall of Famer's right there, yeah. Okay. There we go. Another All monitor. Monitor. And who's on the back here? Jeff Bagwell. Jeff Bagwell. That's a good one. That's a good one right there, yeah. Hall of Famer. He's got a couple cool inserts in the set too. Rogers. Kenny Rogers. These aren't the ugliest wrappers, though. If you look at them, it's just like this plain yellow, yeah. like nothing exciting. The updates were like a dark green, which were a little bit cooler, but... They never opened up really cleanly. Yeah, they really don't. With Troy Hawkins, he had a very long career. Just look at the, the coloring. It's just such a weird design on those. They're kind of fun, though. And, oh, there we go. The big unit... Yes. Randy Johnson. These are the league leader cards. Dude, look at that. That's great. Look at that face. That is an awesome card. Put that up there. That's going to be my top card right now. Ooh, right behind it. We got Jay Buhner. Nice. So we got one there for the go. PC. Love Jay Buhner. Hit a couple more. Commons. Check out that leg kick. Jeez. <laughs> Eric Young. Oh, Eddie Murphy. Murray, not Murphy. Murray. <laughs> yeah, Eddie Murphy. Murphy. Hey, Shrek. Jim Evans, there you go. That's not bad. On the Angels. Yeah, Sean Dunstan. Oh, here we go. 
Oh yeah, I like that one. Tim Salmon Provision. Put right there. There's another 20. Dave, Dave Winfield. Winfield, yep. Great player. I got one more here. Huh? Two more. Maybe. Yeah, that's the fun thing about opening the old stuff, guys, is that the cards stick together. These aren't too bad because they're not all foiled up. But man, the actually, foil he's cards. like right over here, ain't he? Something like that, right? Yeah, I think it's the clouds here, and then he kind of connects the clouds in some way. Connects yeah. right there, yeah. Hopefully, we get a set. That'd be pretty cool. That would be fun. I'm hoping for a hot pack. That'd be awesome. I think Daryl Strawberry. I think I only pulled one hat pack when we were kids. They were hard to get, that's there. for sure. Another all star. You get a lot of those. Greg Jeffries. Frank Thomas. There we go. The big hurt. Yeah. I don't know what he's doing there. He doesn't look like he's fielding. It's like dancing or something. That's a pretty cool card, though. Can't go wrong with the Frank Thomas card. He was killing it in the 90s. Yeah. It was all about him and Junior back in the day. Are. All right. You got the jowl. You got Javi Lopez. That's a sweet card. I love yeah. the cage in the back. I do like that. Yeah, that's a cool picture. Oh. Tony Fernandez. Ozzy Smith. And Cal Ripken. Yeah. Nice. That's a good one. Iron Man. Yep. It's a sweet card. We'll put that one up here. Yeah. Oh, we got one stuck here. Sorry. Checklist card. The checklist, yeah. Jeez. That's the one you didn't want to miss. That's great. Come on. As a kid, I actually liked the checklist in this set because it had so much color, but they're kind of cool. <laughs> it was nice in the 90s to start making checklists with actual players on them, yeah. which made them much more exciting than those old tops ones. Mike Piazza, another Hall of Famer. And if, uh, another, another Hall of Famer right there, Padre Rodriguez. So two great catchers. That's a sick card, actually. I will put it right over there for now. We'll clean it up, find something a little better. Got one stuck. So definitely a lot of, uh, obviously, Hall of Famers in these guys, these mid-90s sets. All right. Yeah, definitely. That's a weird looking card. It is. <laughs> and we got twins. No Kirby yet, though. No. Jay Buhner number two. There you go. So we do got some duplicates in here. We got two Jay Buhners. So that's and there's the awesome. Matt Williams and Wade Boggs again. <laughs> but that's what you don't want is duplicate inserts. Yeah, but that was a very popular insert in this. It was. I think it was like 25 all-star cards. So many cards. of that Kirby Puckett. I mean, plenty of one. <laughs> Former MVP. Yeah, by him. Rafael Primero. Terry Steinbeck. Oh, there's Sammy Sosa. Slamming Sammy. Before it became huge. Yeah. Oh, there's Bob Hamlin's uh, base card. I wish something was so weird that he wore glasses. Yeah, oh, there's the cool one. Crime Dog, Fred McGriff. Oh, yeah, that's a cool card. Sweet card. Another All Star. Man. Carlos Garcia, oh, Will Clark. I know we've got, I think about half of our box right now has been yeah, has been all stars, right. which is pretty common. Um, right. as there is a lot of those. Jim Edmonds is again. There, there's a lot. So I'm turning these cards around while he's opening his. Yeah. <laughs> get him in order. A little time, yeah. There's twins. Get him unstuck. Yeah, get him unstuck. I'm trying to anyways. I did miss a few. There's a Jason Beer. Hey, Barry Bonds. There you go. Should we Put them over here, maybe. Got another twins. Let's go. Channel Park. There you go. Card you're talking about earlier, right? Another Tim Salmon. <laughs> we'll just put them right on top of the other one. How's that sound? Yeah. Spike Owen. All right. Well, this Good pack. This pack was rough. This one must have got in the corner of the box. Look at that. Oh shit. Someone didn't take care of it, so that all got smashed. Oh, we gotta get nothing good in there. Nobody huge in there. Um, Dante Bichette and Paul O'Neill. Luckily, it was just another All Star card. But yeah, seriously, man. man, that's 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 a bummer. Set those off the side there. All right. You got Tommy Glavin here. Hall of Famer. Yeah, let's come over here. Ryan 
Tommy Klesko. Ozzy Guillen. <laughs> Lenny Dystra. There we go, 20. Oh, hey, hey, we got a new one. Jeff Bagwell. Sweet. I think that one. Wait. Where's that one at? I don't know. Is it on that? No. Top. Dude, top I don't top know, thing. man. It's weird if I put it over here, I guess. Dude, I got other packs. I can't remember how those are all set awesome. up. It's been a while. Looking at this here, because I know you can see Tim Salmon's uh, uh, bat in one of the guises. Oh, yeah, it does come up through the top, I think. Yeah, nice. We got a yes. Lumber Company card. Here we go. We're going to get insert Those now. are the more rare ones, weren't These they? These were one of the rare ones, yeah. yeah. Um, In the jumbo boxes, you could get Rookie Sensations. The only good card in that whole set was Manny Ramirez. But Albert Bell, Lumber Company, just a nice clean look. Those are really cool. I think one of my first shimmy him over packs I got from that was Fred McGriff, and I was like, yes, let's go. Yeah, those are really cool. There's a Griffey and a Bonds. And a Frank Thomas, I think, as well, actually. Yeah, yeah, Frank Thomas. I got That was my second one I got. All right, so I got twins. Usually, I think I almost have all the twins here. Definitely cash them in there. Everybody but Kirby so far. Yeah, seriously. I think what his base card looks like. Oh, yes. Here we go. Manny Ramirez. He was like the center guy, wasn't he? No, I think he's a bottom corner, what? actually. Was he really? Yeah, all that. Basically, he... He's little... right below Bagwell, I think. Yeah, I think so. There's a Mariners guy for you. Deion nice. Sanders. Prime, prime, prime time. Prime. Yep. Got Chip Hale. I don't even remember him, honestly. I don't know. A lot of these guys I don't remember. Some I do. Three back. And hey, oh, here we go. Here's a there sweet Kirby Puckett go. card. Yes, let's go. League yeah. leaders. Kirby Puckett, sweet card. We'll, we'll block Cal over there. And oh, Dan Wilson. Awesome card. Love Dan Wilson. Great catcher. Here's Checklist 4. It's funny, it says on the box. You may not get a complete set. I mean, you should. I mean, there's so many packs in here, but I think there was like right. 600 some other. There's seven checklists. I think there's like 700 These cards. These sets are just there. huge, though. Seriously. They are huge. Which made it fun collecting as a kid, you it know? It did, yeah. There we go. Checklist. Checklist, there you go. <laughs> ah, what's this one? Okay, nice. We got back-to-back league, back league nice. leaders. Sweet. Uh -huh. Those are cool cards. I'll put this right here. That was a sweet Griffey one. I've got one of those. Andy but... Van Schleich. Alan Trammell. This lot? Yeah. All right. Getting down to the last few packs here. Oh, we've still got like five, know, maybe a dozen almost. I had a couple damage ones. Yeah, that sucks. Yeah, that's a bummer. I get a couple damage ones there. We got Mario Duncan and Robbie Almar. Why are you guys in Canada up there? It's a sweet card. Mariner. No Griffey yet. And he wasn't in the damage packs, I checked. No Kirby or Griffey. There's Jim Tomey. Sweet card. Hall of Famer, 600 some home runs. Just this pack is really sticking. So bear with me. Because I didn't get them all on stock in time. Greg Vaughn, Max Suzuki, Mariner for you. Gary Gaetti on the Royals. That's weird to see, too. Craig Biggio. We got this one already, I believe, yeah? Yeah, we did. I think that was the first one we got, wasn't it? Yep, I think so. Here we go. These guys are stuck together. Make sure we don't. Yep, sorry. No one great. All right, we got Dodgers. Look at that one. Oh, we got a pretty cool insert coming up, looks like. Mark Lemke. Hmm. Greg Jeffries, Rafael Pomero. And here we go, another lumber, yes, lumber company, Jeff Bagwell. Go. Awesome card. Bell and Bagwell so far, two good guys. I feel like this card had like the least going on with it. Like 
just like it's just <laughs> a name in gold and a number. It just there's not much else. Yeah. L not as busy as the other cards. Jeff Shaw. Brett Manning. Uh, he's got glasses. Yeah. <laughs> Just oh, here we go. Oh, sweet. I think we're going to have to move a card here. Let's move uh, move these back here, huh? Got our A-Rod. Dude, I love that card. I That's a sweet card. I love that card, too. I always like that card. I love that jersey color. Sweet card. That was definitely one of the top cards to get in the set mm -hmm. for the inserts. Got another that Mariners. Much prospect. Louis Soho. Nice. I know, and that was a good pack. Nice, yeah. Nice, nice. Oops. Dropping cards here. Terry Stein back in. There's Sammy Sosa nice. again. Sosa. And we got another prospect. Armado Benitez. I don't remember Benitez. that dude at all. Yeah. Picture for the Orioles. Never mounted them Pretty much. cool. Omar Vizquel. So we definitely hit a couple good ones so far. That Kirby Puckett is pretty awesome. Yeah. Yep. rod and Rainey Johnson too. Still looking for the base card of Gary Sheffield. Uh, <laughs> oh, Sheffield's pretty good. I think Sheffield. his son is in the minor or something like that. Doug now? Jones. And yeah, that's probably the worst one. <laughs> yeah, that, honestly. Oh. Uh, Unless you are, hey, Cal Ripken easy. Jr., sweet. Nice. Let's go. And a checklist. <laughs> checklists. There's definitely a lot of checklists to go around for sure. A twin. And we got the Jeff Bagwell one again. again. That one's pretty cool. It is cool. Got two of them. I do pay. Look at Cal Ripken, back to back Cal's. Hey. That's cool. All right, we'll take it, we'll take it. So we got about, about five left here, guys. Yep, yep, not much left. Getting near the end, still looking for, uh, you know, maybe another, lum another lumber company. Yeah, that'd be nice. Get Frank Thomas, maybe. Did Griffey have one? Was... He had a lumber, he has a lumber company, That's yeah. What I thought. Oh, there's another ProVision coming yeah, up, Pro sweet. Vision. Mike was saying we it. Had Dang, him. we get the same, we got Dang. three of the same ones, so. Oh, no. We have an incomplete puzzle here today, but not looking good. But they are really fun cards. Yeah. I, I, Greg Maddox is one of them. Um, I don't remember who else the other guys were. I don't remember who the other guys were. I really don't. Mary Mares was like the best one, I thought. Marquise Grissom back then. Yeah, he worked the most, anyways. At the time, yeah, he was. Oh, sweet. We got a good one. Here we go. The captain. There's the other prospect you want right there. Jeter for the win, maybe? Oh, yeah. Derek Jeter's prospect card. It's a there sweet go. card. There we go. We got Jeter and the A-Rod. And look at the uh, his jersey number, 24 on the back there. Oh, wow. Instead of two. That's yeah. pretty cool. Didn't notice it back then, but... No. There's your two top cards, I think, right there. Jeter and A-Rod. Probably, yeah. Yeah, definitely. Definitely were the big ones back then. All right. White socks here. John Smoltz. Hey, there we go. There's Frank a big Thomas. Hurt. I like Frank Thomas. Even though I'm a Twins fan, I like Frank Thomas. Garrett Anderson, right? Yeah. Wasn't that card pretty good too? Yeah, he was pretty good back in the day. Good Angels player. Mark Grace. I feel like that card was worth, you know, something decent back then. More Visco. Ray Langford. All right. Shoot. Getting to the end here. Still looking for the, look at that one. That's pretty cool. It's like the Terminator. Yeah, it kind of is. Yeah, Seriously. here we go. Tony Gwynn, League Leaders. We definitely hit the jackpot in the League Leaders, though. Got four of them so far, I think. I'm down to my so, last pack here. This was the one that was sideways on top. The lucky pack? All right. Well, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see how lucky it is. This is this. It's not a hot pack. <laughs> it's not a hot pack. No. no. Let's see what we get. Kurt Schilling. A great pitcher. Yeah. 
Yeah, you guys are new to the channel, definitely check us out. Um, hit the like and subscribe button. We definitely appreciate it. Pudge. Kenny Lofton. I like Kenny Lofton. Yeah. He's fun good, to watch. Good player. Definitely do lots of, uh, you know, we do old school ropes a couple times a month. Um, open new stuff as well. We do blaster battles, all kinds of stuff. And uh, we'll have a few videos out from our brother here this week. Um, so hope you guys enjoyed this box a lot. Here's our final pack. Lessons you guys think of this set. 1995 Fleer. What was your favorite, uh, you know, card out of the set? You know, what insert set did you like? And there is your guy on the cover. Roman Desi. Roman Desi. There is the uh, award winner's card. That was when you get the rookie of the year. It's a pretty sweet card. I'll just put him on there. It's about there. Definitely that's what you guys think, though. So we're going to go striking out on Griffey base yeah. and Kirby Puckett base. We had a couple damage packs, unfortunately. Um, but favorite cards? Mine's going to be the A-Rod, the Jeter, and this cool Randy yeah, Johnson. Yeah, I like the Jeter, too. And you get the awesome Curry Puckett, which is sweet. Yeah, definitely. Provisions, we got duplicates of, I think, three of them. So, yeah, they kind of connect together. I want to say they're these. all staggered almost, honestly. Yeah, they I might be because I think it was yeah. like yeah. they kind of had like a little tornado. With, I want to look it up now. On the bottom there. I don't know what would happen. But oh, we got Sam in this Oh, we did get him as well. I think he's at the bottom. Yeah, so they're going to kind of connect like this. I think these guys are they're not cut very well, but they would connect like this. You can kind of see yep. the water at the bottom. So they're kind of cool. It's a fun set. Fleer did this for like, I think, four years. But I think this is the only year they actually connected to each other. But those are pretty fun. Hope you guys like this, this set. That's going to be it for us today, guys. We're going to have another video here in a little while. Appreciate you guys watching. Until next time, keep on ripping. See ya.